In this section, we're continuing to work on our candle holder, and now we're going to create the candle itself. Let's go back to our front viewport here. And this curve is what we've used for our candle. So I'm going to go once again to my Surface Revolve tool. I'm going to come down here, click, and then using Control plus holding right mouse button, I'm going to scroll up and then zoom back in here. Let's make sure my line is straight. And as long as I'm past the end of this, I'll be OK. And I press OK. And let's take a look and see what our candle looks like. Not bad, except you will notice the candle in proportion to the candle holder seems to be pretty small. So what we're going to do in this case we are actually going to increase the size of our candle by using a scale one-dimensional and we'll scroll out so we can see it a little better we'll do it about to there and to complement that I'm going to change the shape of my candle holder just a little bit by lengthening it. And so that's a little better. We can also change the thickness of our candle by right clicking my scale tool here. I'm going to select, go out here, and we'll just increase the thickness a little bit. Now let's take a look. That looks better. Now we're going to select it here. Solid cap planer holes. And so our candles become solid. So far looking good. I'm going to save my changes.